you know, I've been in this situation before, so it was one that I was, you know, used to. Um, but, you know, hearing the warm reception that the fans gave, you know, it was uh, a nice feeling knowing that they still, uh, still hold a special place in their, in their hearts. What was it like going up against Candice? I mean, obviously you played with her, saw her come into the league, and now you had to defend her, especially in the first quarter. Mm -hmm. What was that like for you? Well, Candice is always a tough guard, but she's an even tougher guard when she's making everyone else around her better. You know, when the ball's not being stuck in her hands, then it's, it's harder to guard her because she's a moving target. And with her abilities, um, you know, you have your hands full. And tonight was one of those nights because she was getting the ball, not being indecisive or stagnant with it. She was moving it, cutting it, and that allowed the offense to just move at a rapid pace. And it was surprising to see them play that quality of basketball off of a back-to-back, -back, you know, and a tough loss to Phoenix, you know, a team that runs and guns a lot. We thought they would be a little leg-weary, but it didn't show at all tonight. I saw Delisha Milton Jones guarding you, former teammate. Delisha was guarding you pretty much in the first quarter. What was that like for you and seeing her in a, uh, this time in the opposite uh, uniform? You know, um, we played against each other before, you know, in San Antonio. We played there. And we played there. Uh, you know, it was a physical game. I know her game very well. She knows mine as well. You know, we're competitors. And I think, you know, after after the game, we shake hands and we go about our business. But, you know, once we're on the court, I, I think we're just opposing players. You have a little guardian angel that make, that's known to make sure that no one gets that physical with you like you did in Phoenix. Um, if you have a little Metal World piece, you know, Junior on your side, what's going on with that? Yeah, apparently my daughter uh, took my nosebleed to her, so she informed me that she would make their nosebleed. So it was hilarious, but um, I like that she cares enough about me to say that.